Salutations, my friends. I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for rejoining me here in Old World Blues, playing as that beautiful Saralza, but really the Grand Teton Collective. So last time, we smashed through, I think, was it, did we smash through, the, through those painted dudes? Was it last time? I can't remember at this point. We smashed through the Withered Dogs, but now we must do some more research regarding our land auction. Last time we, or right before we, I started recording this, we just finished Animal Observations, and now we must get some Night stalk, Stalker Tactics. We get Gorilla Tactics, which looks pretty good for us. I get a better recovery rate and resistance growth speed in our states occupied by the enemy, which is alright, but that's okay. So right now, we're trying to finish up Tribes United, get more war support, which would be a very good thing. More war support, and then building up the hills, we might do that. We're going to get a lot of options, or a lot of choices to take out a lot of different enemies, but we probably should get over to Dead Horses pretty quickly. White Legs, Dead Horses, Forgers, Navajo Nation... I think that'd be great to do, just because I think it's about time for us to go over here to take out Yinta. And Dead Horses, actually, they still border us. Maybe we'll go with them next. Let's do that. How about that? Buffer against the Legion. Another great focus description, but that is okay with me, because I still want to justify on these guys. But we do need to save our political power up so we can core more things. 115 days. Uh, we'll go to war with Dead Horses first. Let's do that one first, even though we still have a lot of resistance. And actually, we should probably buy... Some guns, because we are out of guns. Minus 900-some, 940-some. That's not good. Really not quite good. Uh, buy supply line, too, because we can. 659 caps. Demanding demilitarization. How about no? Very much no. Research speed's okay. 28,000 manpower. Looking pretty good. We actually probably should start building some more stuff up. Resource extraction is very nice. Let's grab that. And then we shall grab... Uh, how about that? Dinosaur caves. Cool. But you guys do that first. And then eventually we want to build all this area up. Let's build up where we have water. That'd be good. Uh, build up wherever we have resources first. That would be probably the most ideal. Build there, there, and then just build it wherever we can. It really doesn't matter too much. Just one moment to build all these areas up, even in places that we can't get to, because I don't really care. It's going to get built regardless, because we have by the end of this campaign, we're going to have so many, many civilian factories, it won't even matter. So, we just did resource extraction. Let's grab some refined tools. I think that would be very beneficial for more cap growth and output, because, well, we could really use a few more... Uh, Guns. We could few, use actually a lot more death claw equipment as well, because we need a lot of water to get this done, which also is affecting our support equipment, which isn't ideal. And we actually need more scrap as well. So I might just do another thing of resource extraction gain, but we'll see what happens. We'll see if, see what happens. Uh, water would be good. Uh, what do we have for military high command artillery? I think we wanted dynamite. How much dynamite do we have? Buffer against legion. Yeah, that's not bad. Our guys are taking a while. That's okay. Now, we could keep doing this, but I want to save this for a little later, just because we might not... Some of these nations might get taken out, and I don't want to do... I don't have wasted stuff. So I asked you guys yesterday, the main question, two questions, actually. We're going to go with restructuring next, but I asked you guys whether we should go down Maritime Trade or Cryptographic Radio Station. Now, there's, there's actually quite a bit of support for both sides, and uh, I, I want to do both, but we can't. So, I said yesterday, I was, or in the last video, I was pulling for the right side here with trade routes and teachings of the Chicago Principle, but you guys came up with good reasoning as to why we should go with maritime trade, because this way we get dockyards, we get construction speed, which I love, and arms workshops, while on this side, we get encryption and decryption, which is okay. We get trade routes, which really doesn't do much for us. But then we also get, like, we can create our own faction, which is cool, but we don't really get much on the side at all. Like, really, we don't get too much that we can physically use, so... That's actually a really good point why we should go down Maritime Trade. But I think overall, there's just a little bit more support. Just a tiny bit more support for the right side. If I play as this uh, nation again, as using literally just or playing as Saralza, I'll go with the opposite option. So I'll choose Maritime Trade next time if we play this again as Saralza. We'll go with uh, old train train system. But let's go ahead and do restructuring. Oh, 60 days. More construction speed, 5%. Not much, but it's worth it. So, yeah, I mean, it was just a little bit, just a tiny bit more support for that other side. So, I mean, it is what it is. And we're slowly getting more intellectual support. Yes, good. At least support looks like it's going down. Ruler support looks like it's going down. Maybe. Yeah, it is, it's slowly going down. That's good. Political power. I mean, really, all this stuff here, I could save it for coring more stuff, which we'll probably do instead. I think that's a little bit more important for now. Wait, max the localizer. More resources, less resources to market. Uh, I want to build stuff up. You know what? Let's use... Let's get max the localizer so we get more water. We can extract just even a little bit more water. That would be good for dynamite. That would be great for mutated tail spikes and armor plates. I think that would be great. Now, the question is, do we go to war with them? Probably. Um, where are you guys? Why are you taking so long, man? I mean, we should have... Yep, uh, 
we got it the entire time. You guys take forever. Holy cow, what is going on? 1.5 kilometers, it's the infrastructure here. It's the infrastructure. Why did this person get over here so quickly? Hmm, but we're, we're quite veterans. Quite quite good veterans here. Manpower, I love it. Uh, actually, resistance. How is resistance doing? What's that pacification? I'm going to keep it on this for now. That looks pretty good. Wither dogs, we just conquered. Painted men is looking pretty good. Of course, Iron Alliance. Uh, let's go West Side Eradication. I mean, even with Eradication, we still get more compliance. Escape Slice from Yinta. Are you Inta? Freedom is the right of every way. Slander. Yep. Well, until they're under us. Oh, look at that. Yeah, we're not going to tolerate any sort of resistance group here, so... Bye-bye. Scavengers found something. Better in our hands than our enemies. Great. Old World Tactics. More attacking defense for a couple of days. New Reno's joining the NCR. Everyone is joining the NCR in this campaign. Wow. They got the Rangers. They got New Reno. Do they have New Klamath with them as well? They do. They do. And actually, they also have Vault City. Everyone has joined the NCR. So that's not good for uh, frequency, frequency analysis. The analysis is next. That's not good for the Legion, but who cares? Actually, the Legion has an enemy. That's good for us, right? That's pretty good for us. So yeah, that's good. That's good. Ah, 60% see. So now, uh, 28.8. It's maybe slowly going to go up eventually. It'll probably go up once we get less resistance restructuring. And I know this is to disappoint some people, but we will go with this side just because it's just a little bit more support. So, more encryption, more decryption, Deathclaw radio, because we are intelligent Deathclaws. We get 1.13 a day, not bad. Uh, yeah, maybe eventually we'll get some more stuff. Resistance modifier is currently not active. This one is active. More dam garrison penetration chance, damage to garrisons. That's not ideal. Uh, is this going up? 0.3. It is slowly going up, which I don't like. Eradicate them for now. Which will require more units. Infantry armor, we don't have enough of it yet. And it's slowly going down. Sorry about that. People, my... One of my uh, the parents is yelling at the cats, probably. Whatever, my apologies. Uh, frequency analysis. Let's go with polyalphabetic ciphers. Very good. Very, very good. And... Ooh, ooh, technology, research speed, medical... We should probably do medical stuff, but let's go and course some stuff. My goodness, these people take so long to get down here. Uh, refined tools, very good. Very good. Let's grab some more extraction. We can really use that dedicated equipment. I'm not too worried about seed selection. I mean, sure, infrastructure construction speed is nice, but it's only 2%. And monthly population gain, 10, 10 right now. Not the most. Not not a lot. Really not a lot. Uh, let's keep going this way. Dinosaur, ooh, we need 160 decor. Okay, we're going to wait to do that one. That's pretty good decor, actually. I keep an eye on this as we wait for these guys to slowly make their way down here. My gosh, you take so long to move. Man, I thought Death Clouds could be really quick. Apparently, they're feeling a little sluggish right now. It was going down by 0.4 day. Yeah, about by 0.4. That's pretty good. I like that. How's the uh, compliance, though? 0.9. Nah, it's not going up any at all. That's okay, though. There goes the Marlock tribe. They're annexed by the good old trolls. And... That's looking so much better now. Resistance eradication. 0.2. Oh, by 0.5. About, point, about 0.45 a day. And we'll go to worse. Why is this set up so not well? Yeah, no. Like, you have six in one army. Um, 3-3-3 three, three, three makes a lot more sense than 6-2-1. But let's get some Kazura Venom. The real enemies. Or the real tough part to kill off in our army. Yeah, those guys are pretty tough. Alright, everyone go, go back to West End Pacification. That's fine. It'll get more resistance for now. Actually, it's still going to get lower, which is good, but it should be controllable now. Let's get some more research speed. Complicated circuitry. Uh, I think that'd be best, so then we can research things even faster, faster, faster. And you have cryptographic radio st uh, radar stations. Uh, trade routes. Because we might as well. I might as well go with teachings of the Chicago Principles, and then we'll move on to the other question I asked you guys yesterday. This will be nice, but it doesn't really matter too much. Very good. Manual prospectors. Ah, yes. Agricultural experts. We gotta get that immediately. Minus 18. That's fine. And let's go ahead and go to war. See what happens. They shouldn't be able to kill us off. We'll see what happens. Yeah, they'll them attack us. Can they pierce us? They might be able to. It does not look like it. And we are entrenched as well, so. Ah, I love winning on the defense. 480. Not bad, not bad. We should do pretty fine. Uh, maybe They might navally invade us, maybe. I don't know. I doubt it, but we'll see what happens. Oh. We don't have a lot of war support stability now. It is what it is. Whatever. How much manpower does this nation have, actually? Not that much. And it's only going to go down, which is a great thing. Ah, it went back up. Maybe they're mobilizing some. 
876, 863, 854. They're losing about 9 a day, maybe. Maybe a little bit more than that. I don't know. They have 14 divisions. Okay, stockpile. Not bad. They got a, ba a lot of basic weaponry, which is fine. They're going to run out of manpower sooner than anything else, which is good. Uh, what are you learning how to become a desert fox? A hills fighter? Oh. Okay. Uh, local leader wouldn't be bad, but we don't really need that. We want smooth talker, beloved leader, lust defense. I don't want lust defense. Uh, let's see, what do we want here? Uh, infantry, it, like we confirmed last time, this death claws are considered infantry. Equipment capture ratio gain. No one's using death claw spikes like we are. Fortunate leader. We'll go with better attacks, so maybe we can get Fortunate Leader next. I think that'd be pretty good. Oh, NCR declared war on the Brotherhood of Steel. Oh, yeah. The Brotherhood of Steel probably has no chance to survive against the NCR with New Arena, with the Rangers, with Vault City. They probably have no chance. That's okay with me. Alright, very good. Alright. Uh, Dinosaur Caverns. Can we please add you to the group? We're about to get paid soon as well. Thank you very much. 33,000 goes up to... 33.14 goes to 33.12. Point one. Okay, so we cored it, and then we lost... Losing quite a bit of manpower, wow. Oh, we actually oh, we actually got duckyards from doing that. Nice, we got some dynamite, too. Uh, get some convoys. Convoys are nice, right? Ah, we're looking better on water, that's nice. Alright, so we didn't get any manpower from that. Probably because we were already probably getting enough non-core manpower that by coring it, it didn't do too much. But hey, that helped our scrap, too. Hey, now nah, that's nice. That's really nice. That's really, really good. Trade routes? I love trade routes. And let's do Teachings of the Chicago Principles. We'll become known as the Steel Claws, send volunteer forces, and we create our own faction, which means absolutely nothing, but that's okay, because it makes us feel better about ourselves. And that's what it means to be a Death Claw, to feel better. Wow, we need more infantry equipment, huh? Hmm. Not ideal. What's going on with that? Uh, this is probably slow, slowly going back up again. Dedicated equipment is good. Uh... Hmm. Let's grab some more defense. Militia training, I think that, that'd be quite ideal. What are we building? Factories, good. Keep building more factories. Those are nice. Two things on factories at all times. I think that'd be quite good. 20%, 10%, 10%, 30%. Dude, I think we... Kriag, I think we already cored that. Yes, we did. That's good. And our deficit is only minus 2600. 2610, I guess. If we can improve that, that would be nice. But that's going to take quite a bit of time. As long as we don't fight someone who has anti-tank, we'll be fine for now. So another comment from yesterday was with these focuses, I, we, whether we should go down the armory route or should we go down with what we created to get super death claws? And there was overwhelming support for the questions yesterday at the time of this recording for us to choose what we created. So we shall get super death claws. Uh, like I said before, and if I ever play a Saralza again, we will go with the Armory as well as the Old Train System. But for this campaign, we'll go down here. And uh, another comment from yesterday as well included, the next time I play with the Death Claws, um, I should go down the route that lets us ally with the Legion. Yes, that is what uh, was recommended. Now, I'm o totally okay with that. But the only uh, prerequisite I have for playing with the one that likes the Legion, we we'll get some war camps right now, uh, is that you gotta remind me. You just gotta remind me to play as a Legion next time I play as Death Claws, so just so that we get it, I remember we, you know, kind of get it done. It'd be kind of cool. It's not really getting it done, but just playing as. Have a good time as people who like the Legion. R more recon. Ooh, yeah, let's get some more recon on her, guys. That'll be nice, because these guys, he's getting 12 and a half. This group's getting 12 and a half. Tons of recon. We can figure out where the enemies are at. Can we, ooh. Can they pierce us? No, they can't pierce us. Not even their special forces hopefully can pierce us. Are they up here? Oh, they actually, yes they can. They can pierce us, but we can't pierce them, which sucks. But the enemies are still not that strong. So, send them on your prospectors. Yeah, might as well. Equipment's looking pretty good. 577 goes down, goes up to 594. Just wanted to see if we were losing any. Oh, yeah, we're doing pretty well. We are now considered a major power, my friends. We are a major power. And which we now we're going to do what we created. Attempts to work with FEV have ended amazingly and have not collapsed. And the development of the mutants and animals power they become even smarter, stronger, more enduring. But this technology, although costly to us, it will cost our efforts. Oh, that does not sound good. What is it going to cost us? But now we're only minus 2.95, 2.59 thousand pieces of equipment. Capture the Lost Souls Bunker. There goes the Western Brotherhood. Good job, guys. Good job, NCR. Storage. That our FEV stockpile. Oh, start the research. Ooh, Death Claw Super 1. Well, we might as well do number 2. Hopefully this doesn't hurt us. 
I really hope it doesn't hurt us. Uh, oh, we get tanks? Um, I kind of want to see what they look like. We'll put them under... We'll, we'll kind of save that for later on. Sort of, maybe. Just because I want to make sure we got enough supplies for our regular death claws and stuff. First generation, cool. Oh, we actually maybe created a few divisions. Nice. So we're done with the right side of the tree now. So we can focus basically all on the left side. Cool. And this is really big. The NKVD people support for death claws. Very nice. Let's build up the hills because we can. And where are you at? Great Warrior. 30 combat width. With death claws best, locked. 35 armor. Are you guys all the same? Okay, okay, that makes that looks a little better. 30 combat width might be a little too thick for my liking. Uh, actually, what equipment do they use? Um. Well, death claws super. Okay. Okay. Well, whatever. Uh, I'll put you over here, maybe. Actually, how much supply do you guys use? Po point eight. That's. That's not bad. Oh, look. Leader. Sallow, Agile, Perceptive, Charismatic. Let's go with Charismatic. Aka. Inspirational. That's why I went with Charismatic. Local leader would be good. Uh, get. Mm, you're not considered infantry, so they don't get extra recon for this group. We're going to go with local leader next. I think that would be kind of ideal. That manpower is looking pretty nice, though. We get almost one a day. Very good. Keep building us up. Aka. I just hired you, Aka, and you fall ill? Ooh, Kazador Venom, very, very nice. Very nice. Good, and we'll grab some Deathclaw Ferocity. Hey, it's just, it's almost in our name. Deathclaw. More breakthrough, more soft attack, I think it said. For leg infantry, yes. All right, so how many losses have we taken? We've got a little more army XP of 150 losses versus 3,000. That really ain't bad. Especially since I haven't really been paying attention here too much. Please get another civilian factory. That That is just so broken for like, 30 political power, you get a free civilian factory. It's not much, but if you do it constantly over time, I mean, it's it just helps you produce so much. I love it. Medical tech, medical stuff. And it looks like, for the most part, we've put down a lot of potential rebellions, which is good. And now we have this. Great. Let's go ahead and do Tribes United. To get a little bit more war support, because we could always use more war support, let's be real. Uh... We still got Jerry the Stormtrooper, which we love. So, Tekkens, I, I just realized that that's her, that's her capital right there. NCR, oh, they took out the Western Brotherhood of Steel, and now they have a civil war. That is unfortunate, my friends. Da that's a big Daglo. Holy cow. The NCR basically almost. Oh. Okay, the Bonaire's looking pretty small. The NCR has basically been relegated to other parts. Hold on, let's get some slashing melee equipment. That'll help us out, probably. Um. This portion here, as well as a former Brotherhood territory, the Baron's Republic's up here. I don't think any of these guys have a unique focus tree, do they? Gifts of our forefathers, gifts of our forefathers. And, of course, they're still down here, too. Daglo uh, and Boneyard, give it the interesting... No national focus set. Okay. Well, y'all do you, and we'll kind of hang out here. We do want to go to get to the Lone Trees pretty quickly. After this, we got to go to war with Uinta. Have a good time with them as we are slowly trying to improve our equipment levels here. Are we still minus 2.59 from the ashes? From the Brotherhood of Steel, one slot defeat has re returned from the ashes or risen from the ashes. Well, we've made about 70 more pieces of equipment. Ah, they joined the Boneyard Brotherhood. Now, that is unfortunate. Why well, looks clear war on Tower Walkers? Uh, actually, is it faction? Oh, the NCR? Well, th you should really get call your, all of your allies in, especially the Klamath and uh, New Reno. That would probably be pretty good to do. That's just me, though. Uh, we could do this. New Vegas. I think I'm going to wait. Unification of the tribes. Um, I'm going to say we'll wait. You know what I'm going to do? We're going to just let time go on as we're defending and reap and get all the political power that we can possibly get. I don't want to do a focus for now. I don't think it would be very beneficial for us right now. So let's wait. Let's just wait. I want to core more stuff. That's, that's my goal right here, right now. These guys are probably still a little bit too strong. I want to throw you guys in the mix, but supply might not be good enough. Work camps are nice. Rapid prototyping, we might as well do that. Go ahead and have a good time with that. Ah, beautiful. Look, we need less. Now that's nice. We get our factory back. We got enough water. This is turning out pretty nicely. Alright. Throw you guys on the line, get closer. Scam just found something. A land auction bonus. Even though we don't really need that anymore. If I throw you guys here, will that hurt supply? Can they pierce? Oh, no. Probably not. Cool. 
So the goal is to get around these guys quickly enough. Ooh, hurting supply just a little bit. That's okay. All right, see if we can core anything else around here. We got dinosaur caverns. Uh, another factory actually would be quite ideal. Civilian core of that place. That's fine with me. More factories, please. Thank you. All right, so we can attack here. Take the capital. Cut these guys off. I think that sounds... Okay, you look like you're a militia unit. It's okay, whatever. Everyone go there, except, like, two divisions. You just go there. See what you can do. Can we win? We should probably get some planes, too. It looks like it. they mostly cannot pierce us at all, which is nice. Very nice. Uh, potential for technology. Get some aid. See some patriotism. No, it's not really worth it. So they lost about 4,000. We've lost about 160. Not bad, I'd say. Get down there as quickly as possible. Hey, we overran a couple divisions. Hey, look at that. That's really nice, actually. Ah, uh, now they've suffered 5,000 casualties, and they're just going to go bye-bye. If you can, go get over the river quickly. Nice. Quickly, do not let them move in. And we... Oh, there. Very good. Go, go, go. Go that way if you can. I'm going to have you guys go up here. Hopefully, as time goes on... Oh, crap, we need more water. Yeah, we just got dang it. Well, uh, Navajo Nation, thank you for your assistance. Good. You might as well take them out like that. There you go. Beautiful. And that's going to be a lot more resistance, but honestly, I think we got enough infantry equipment for that, and we got more than enough. Deathclaw power. Man power. Deathclaws go roar. Yeah, Deathclaws roar, yeah. Red Henry, that should have been enough, but whatever, that's fine. After this, you went to right. Uh, we have a war goal against them. No, we don't. Crazy horns. Hmm. All right. Let's see. We got crazy horns or crazy curtain. New Hammond, 80s Myrtle. Oh, uh, Kimmel Station, Shoshone, Eastport, Cyclops. Nope. Looks like we'll have to manually justify on them. Fine with me. Whatever. 115 days is gonna take a while. That's okay. Oh my goodness. They got a lot of cores. Go, 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 thank you very much. Very nice. Guess next we're just gonna go right there. Oh, wait, hold on. Actually, now we can actually use these guys more effectively. So you three, you'll kind of stay right there. You three, kind of stay right there. And you six, go right there. There we go. It helps out supply, helps out, you know, weight issues, supply issues. Manual prospectors sound pretty good to me right now. We're not using your guys too much, so go right ahead. Focus on internal sphere. No, thank you. No, no, no. We're about to get paid. There you go. Very nice. Death block equipment. Minus 2.46. Not bad, my friends. Not bad. Over here, not every place is worth coring, but yeah, some places still are. 7,000 some. It's definitely worth coring this one instead of the other one up north. So give me just a few more days and we can do uh, coring the state. And it looks like New Canaan is on fire a little bit. Ah, beautiful. 43 factories, and we've just finished our land auction, my friends. It's going to be a great time. Let's grab some gliders. Finally, gliders. Even though we probably can't afford too much. 43, we enter 46 factories. Not bad. Not bad at all. <sighs> very good. Very, very good. I would want to train these guys, but... Mm, wow, that's a lot of divisions up there. Not going to lie, that's a lot. That is quite a few, but... And this is a huge, but 47 factories? Nice. Slowly improving our ability to make more and more factories. Oh my goodness, we need so much here. Slashing melee weaponry, thank you. If we really need it. Uh, we're not even making this, so there's no point. We're not even using that yet. There's no point. Support companies. Dynamite. We haven't used it yet either, so we're going to wait. Robotics. Get some more efficiency cap. Sure, why not? Automation. It's fine. I should probably honestly get more resource extraction, but whatever. It's fine for now. It's fine for now. Uh, agricultural experts. Yep, we got to do that again. And we have enough political power. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. You guys looking good? You guys looking, well, decent as, as can be. That's still not a bad amount of soft attack, considering you have still 4.2 armor. Actually, what is the ability of the enemies here? Do they have anti-tank? At this point, it's mid-game. No. Yes, the militia units of all divisions have it, but as well as their infantry, which is not a good thing, but defending over here which should be fine. Oh, Deathball Assault Trooper, huh? Um, yeah, you're a normal com 20 combat with division with chems on them. Nice. Sure, Dayglo. Sure. Oh, K's claws. 
Oh, are these the paratroopers? That's a lot of defense, not gonna lie. That's a crap ton of defense. 500 some? These guys normally have a crap ton of defense as well. That's a crap ton of break. Oh my god. Wait, so two? Two are considered 15 combat width? Are you nuts? Two here. Hold on. Uh. uh Death Claws. These have double their defense. And more than double the breakthrough. Double the heart attack. I mean, they don't get a recon. But... Oh my god, those special forces. Ugh. Honestly, uh, new group. K's Claws. Infantry. Death Claws. Only 100 plus 137. Um, hop. I can't add any more. But if I add on K's claws, it actually lowers lowers the piercing. The, oh, the, look at the speed, 16. I mean, the breakthrough is not bad. That's a butt ton of soft attack, though. That's a huge butt ton. This slows your divisions way down. But 30 combat width just probably isn't ideal. You actually get more armor if you put on K's claws. Oh my goodness. Just... I, 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 hmm. Is 40 combat width really worth it by slowing us down by that much? I don't know, man. That just looks so good, though. Right, let's keep doing this as well. This will be nice. Uh, do that. There you go. And probably do that, too. Rapid prototyping. Very good. Uh, let's grab some uh, better bricks. I love bricks. Death claws know how to use bricks. Sell some stuff, get some gliders, yes, please. Finally, let's get some motorized flight, that'd be great. We don't have enough factories for any of this stuff, but that's okay. God dang, we need more resources. Ah, oh, there goes Dayglow. Eh, whatever. Didn't really care too much. Uh, I can't go to the distressed outsiders, that sucks. Actually, we gotta go down here next. Maybe. Let's see, over here. Infrastructure, construction speed. Uh, stability would be nice. F ball, power armor, energy, demo, weapon equipment. We might go with this one, rough and ready shovelers, but since we're here. Actually, that's not a bad core. Did I core this yet? I have not. It's not really worth coring, though. I mean, it helps us with defense, but do we really need more defense for that for now? That's really good at core. We already did, which is good. Uh, this is not bad at core either. Either. Either one of these two is really just not worth it. I'm going to core this one so we can maybe get some more water. If you core stuff to get more resources, it's minus 31. Okay, so there you go. That's better. Scavengers found something? Great. No Naval targeting system? Well, I wouldn't say that's the greatest thing we found. That's okay, though. It's okay. So some updated equipment, military stuff. All right. When can we go to war? Hopefully we can go to war very soon. I'm ready to go to war. Uh, 999 caps. Not bad. 994. We got 10 days. 10 days left, my friend. 10 days. Keep building. We're almost there to build, start building up the nest, which is a good thing. And we're going to get 2.7 a day. Not bad. How much manpower does you went to have? Uh, not much. They have less than 1,000, which is good. Not many convoys. So we got a couple divisions here. Uh, cool. They have a couple destroyers. Uh, did I have... A, I don't have any fleet either, huh? There we go. Uh, I guess we could try it and see what happens, you know. And also, let's take a look at that. Ah, the steel claws. I love it. Beautiful. I did say I want to go to war with the scorpions, but we'll see. But we'll see what happens, you know. Um, guys, please. I know it's not great around here. It really is not. But I really want Altona. So that's where Altona is. I was wondering where that was. All right. So they're attacking us like crazy. They can counter pierce. Oh, we can counter pierce them. They can counter pierce us to a degree. Yeah. Guys, keep attacking. See what happens. That'd be awesome. Thank you. Thank you very much. Supply's gonna be so bad through here, though. How much do we need to core? Ah, uh, just go and core that. Screw it. Why not? Dead horse point. Not bad. Just, we probably need way less stuff here. Good. Iron Alliance is looking not too bad. A lot of this place is looking pretty good now. Go and come up to there, too. Or Nine Mile Ranch. Let's do that one. Go to the Ram Ranch. Good. They're so focused on the other side that they don't care about what's actually happening, but okay. Uh, resource infrastructure. Oh, uh, because more resource efficiency gain with resource production. Yes, please. These guys are like, these death claws are like power armor, but they don't need energy, which is really nice. Which is actually really, really nice. Um, yeah, just go ahead and take it. I'll 
they they they're okay. I mean, if this is what they want, I mean, this is good with me. Hope it's good with you. Oh crap! We get get all the way to Wild Mountain. Um, if they don't move, or if they start moving, we will uh, start attacking them. Uh, one division isn't too bad. Start, I guess, taking everything else. If they're not really doing too much. Barrier goes Baron's Republic. Okay, they just just stood there. Great, awesome, yeah. Why not? Guaranteed by New Canaan. I don't know, New Canaan. I'm not really sure if you can really afford another war right there. Are you in your own little Mormon alliance? Yeah, you are. Uh, actually, you know, we're gonna go to War with Lone Trees next because we have cores on their lands. So I think that'd be quite bueno in my opinion. Now, I kind of want to see what these guys can do by themselves. Because we can go to war immediately for these guys. Uh, how much? How strong are these guys? Motorized flight, that's nice. They have a lot of divisions. Wow, let's grab some lightweight metals first, though. Oh, my goodness, we need so much water. It's ridiculous. 2.2, how about we go down to 2.3? There we go. That's a little better, maybe. Maybe not. Send out manual prospectors, perhaps. Good. So down here, have we cored pretty much everything around here? Where the painted men were? For the most part, yes. For the most part. Uh, anything around here we could core? Uh, actually, we could core that too. Is it really worth it though? There's, I don't see that many resources around here really worth core, and that's not bad. Going this area would, wouldn't be bad either. I think going down here would be pretty good. You core that, so that's nice. Actually, core, getting that core would be pretty good as well. What if we... You know, we can't core that yet. So, if we could core this, that'd be great, but we cannot just yet. Bricks are nice. Bricks are very good. Let's grab some more electrical extraction, because we could really use more resource efficiency gain. Death clock limit went back up to minus 2.57. As long as it doesn't get any worse, I'm okay with that. Alright, let's see what happens. Uh, I might actually throw you guys right here, then. Good. Alright, three... Do they have anti-tank? They might. They probably do have anti-tank by this point. Yeah, they do. Uh, give us just a little bit more time, and we'll get a little bit more entrenchment, and then we'll go to war. Uh, stuff is okay. Uh, additional planning, because we can. Why not? Three, two, we got plenty of political power. Go ahead. They're not attacking me. Okay. I thought they would be. Okay, then. Hmm. How is reason? How, how are these guys doing? Rebuilding the Westlands, nice. Is this going up anymore? 2.27? No, it's going down. Good, 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 good. Uh, it's probably good to core the Withered Dogs area next. Um, we don't even core all of Yampa yet, but it's so close. I guess we must have core that. It's only 73 political power. Just to say we got rid of that. Now, I kind of hope they would attack me. Do I need to, like, move you out or something? Actually, uh, yes, go for every cap in the arms. We get more factories to use. That's awesome. And then we can go to the Distrust Outsiders. I think that'd be the best thing we could do. Go and do that too. Well, I guess they really don't care about attacking me. So, do that too. See what happens. 1.96. I just want my core territories, man. That's all I care about right now. That's all I want. Yeah, if I try to attack, they'd probably demolish us. So, we'll see what happens. At the very least for this campaign, I don't know if it's, I don't think this will be a full waste campaign, but let's get at least get through every single nation that we can go to war with. I think that would be a very good goal for us. Get through all of these nations that we can go to war with, and then clean up the borders a little bit from there. Because I think that'd be that would be probably the best thing we could do. They really don't they really don't care about attacking me, huh? What if I attack them? Could we actually win? Maybe. I mean we're getting pierced. But 34 ain't lying. Um, we have a crud ton of breakthrough. Like, oh my goodness, so much breakthrough. It's ridiculous on these divisions. Why do you expect that soldier now? Your breakthrough, 280, 2, 285, I mean, just. And these divisions, okay, maybe not a ridiculous time. 56 is pretty bad. But 63, I still ain't bad either. We're, we're slowly winning. I mean, yeah, we're doing a great job. 179, additional plating, great. How do we get some more breakthrough? Yep, there we go, more breakthrough. Guerrilla tactics. Yes, yes, please. Yes, please. Sign me up. If we start running out of places to do stuff with, I mean, we could always support this area. It's fine with me. I don't really care. Re Reno declared war on the Yakuza territories. Well, I feel bad for them because they're completely surrounded now, but. No, oh, whatever. 
Whatever. Good for them. And so we'll get more water, too, which is actually very nice. Now we only have minus 59. Not bad. 57 factories. Scavengers found something great. Hey! Stent a security solution uh, schematics. Very nice. Actually, here's a comment. What should we call our intelligence agency? We are an intelligent Deathclaw, Steelclaw society. But even then, we should be, we should have a name as well, should we not? Like, what do you think it should be? Uh, Super Deathclaw Intelligence Agency. S-D-I-A. Hmm. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. I'm, I'm interested in hearing what you guys have to say regarding a potential Deathclaw Intelligence Agency name. They've already lost 700 guys compared to us. That's ridiculous. Oh, they have Holy War? Oh, that's actually good for us. They're almost out of manpower, too, which is good, 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 good. Even though it's killing off our equipment levels. But hey, we're doing better. Minus 2.3? That's not bad. Almost... Really almost minus two point. Okay, we won the battle. All right, sure, sure, why not? We throw everyone here though. Get some organization, get a lot of planning. Planning, surprisingly, can do, ex well, not surprisingly, can do a lot of goodness for you. And they're attacking us, even though we're probably at least a little bit entrenched. Just a little bit entrenched everywhere. Uh, not bad. 44,000 manpower. Very nice. Help settlements out. Yes, please. Even more civilian factories. Build, build, build. We have a third run going. Electrical extraction. Thank you very much. You might as well grab some, not power stations, but water stations. One of the few times I actually have to get basic well pumps. I almost never have to get those. Oh my gosh, look at that infantry division. They're so weak. We've only cut off 2400, but Jesus. Please, please attack me again. Please make our day. Please. Well, the White Legs are doing a pretty good job. Actually, we went to war with the White Legs now. That wouldn't be too bad. Help them out. That does help us reduce a potential enemy later on, but that's okay. Manual prospectors, don't mind if we do. Aid. How many guns do we have? 16,000? It's not bad. Oh, good, 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 good. Over here, go ahead and put them down. Eradicate the resistance. Uh, that's a okay. case. Slashing melee weaponry. Let's do that. Share the wealth. Oh, actually, we're ruining that more. That's okay. Uh, yeah, we just, we just need so much water. That's just for the most part. We just need so much water. Death Gloss Assault. You're 20 combat with? Yes. Nice. Uh, if I told you all just to go to attack, could you win? Just look at that. Look at their strength level. They're just dying like crazy. It's almost like when I played as a Blackfoot tribe in, Shat in not Shattered Wasteland. Sweet Home California. I mean, the enemy's strength just drops. And I, and I love it, but it's a wee bit ridiculous, not gonna lie. Of course, once we get a good foothold on the enemy. But, my goodness. It can be really good. Oh, yeah, look at that. Drop in their strength. Just, if I threw on dynamite, it would hurt our armor, definitely. And we don't have that much to go with, or go off of. But if we get more divisions. Actually, what is our normal armor? Like, with these guys, it's actually, it's, these are literally just power armor. This is literally power armor if we have full strength divisions. And I throw on, like, actually. So, basically, an entire row is... 20 combat with. Another row would be 40 combat with. If I did another one, it would be 60 combat with. Ima can you imagine if I made these guys 40 combat with Deathclaw divisions? The enemies would just be decimated. There'd be no bodies left. Oh, I can't wait. That sounds like fun. Help them out there. Good. And slowly we're getting our resources and cores back, especially Teutonic Hills. Very nice. Very, very nice. I doubt I can core that one again. That's fine. All right. We eradicate a lot of resistance. Let's get some monoplane fighters since we want to really help with the fighters here. Death claws and planes. That sounds like a very dangerous thing to have. Not gonna lie. But that sounds like a lot of fun, I'll be honest. That sounds like a lot of fun. Death claws and planes. Yes, please. Well, song from the front. War support. Let's get some more war support. As much as I want political power right now, it's hard to get more war support. Guerrilla tactics. Our breakthrough gets even better. CQC training, even though we're not even using our enforcers yet, might as well, right? Might as well. Actually, why have I not put on CQC stuff or crowd control stuff? What the heck, Mr. Mocha Lover? Are you even really playing the game? Do you even know what you're doing? Somewhat. Somewhat. Almost 2.8 a day. Roughly 3 a day for mutated tail spikes and armor plates. Just, mm, I love it. Come on, guys. We got plenty of planning. I probably need to get some logistic companies on these guys, though. Yeah, that'd probably be best. Get some more planning done, and at this point, just start coring whatever we can around here. Uh, there's no water there. There's water here. That'll help out. Can I core that? Yes, I can. Get some more water. Not bad. Really not bad. 
Resource wise, well, minus 37, that's doing a lot better than before. Oh, they want to cut us off. That is no, 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 no. Please begin attacking, guys, please. Do that. You just go for the Teutonic. Teutonic Hills. Oh, look at that division. It's going to die. Oh, it died. It died. Oh, thank you, Lone Trees, for playing. Oh, wait. What? Did we not get everything? Evanston. Hello. Thank you. Very nice. Who can we go to war with next? Bellingham Old Country Forgers. White Legs. Ooh, go to war with the White Legs. You know what? Why not? I'll put a couple divisions there. We'll put a couple divisions down here just in case. These guys have a little bit of trouble. We'll put a couple divisions uh, down there. And with the conquering of the White Legs, the White Legs, I mean, uh, these guys, Lone Trees, we get our cores back. Which is exactly what I wanted. And you know what? Broken Coast, we don't care about you right now. Tectonic Hills, go ahead and repair all that stuff first so we can actually use them. Because so there will be literally no resistance over here for us. Which is a good thing. This stuff will be made quickly and efficiently. Oh, we're about to get paid soon for more caps. Not really needed, though. Death Claws, Aider... What do you mean, Death Claws, Aider... Are Death Claws cannibals? Death Claws must be cannibals. They must be. Basic wall pumps? Very good. Very, very, very good. Grab the second level. Advanced wall pumps. I usually don't do this, but make some water. Why not? Yampa would be a really good, great place to put it in, but we'll put it in Wilcox first. I think we cored this place. Oh, we did not. Okay. Never mind. Okay. At this point, let's go ahead and do another one. Let's see. We're pretty close to other places here. Uh, that's not bad. We're not going to do that one yet. Uh, do the Raider Traps because we can. Why not? Lose about 10 political power, but that's okay. Now, you guys are centered here. Y'all, hopefully... It looks like New Canaan's holding on, so I'm actually going to put you guys... You know what? Bring on these tanks. I mean, they're literally just tanks at this point. Do that. Come on down here and see what we can do. Because we're looking pretty weak. They might have... Yeah, it looks like they do have some anti-tank on them. Not ideal. Get some more organization for platoon training, though. And maybe we'll get some heavy hammers. 81 factories. That's nice, man. That's really nice. Ah, uh, yes. Make another one. Resource-wise, looking pretty darn good. Not gonna lie. Oh. Give me what I want, man. Uh. Just asking for what I, I asked for. That's all I want. Uh, do we have any other upgrades yet? Not yet. Okay, give us a few seconds, and then we'll go back to war. Uh, I want a little bit more entrenchment first, though. Just a little bit more. Increased by 2% each day. That's not much. We get a 10% defensive bonus. And I want more planning. More planning would be nice. 2.4% every day. Raider tribes. And let time go on again so we get some more political power. Because political power is awesome. Uh, we can't do this yet. We need 141 political power. 60% stability. Not bad. 80s declared war in Vault City. Oh, that is not good, 80s. You went to war with the NCR after they won their civil war. Oh, boy. That is... Peculiar, and they got the cores back on here, it looks like. Yeah. I would say that's kind of a mistake, 80s, but you know what? Y'all do you, and I'll do the white legs. Actually, how much? 3,000 manpower. Let's see what happens. They might actually be able to beat us back, maybe. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling like I'm a little apprehensive here, like going to war with other people, just because it doesn't seem like uh, we do we could do well, but every time I'm... Okay, they, they left the line. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, go down there then. Okay, sure, why not? Why not? Why not? I mean, if, if they really don't want to be here, I'm going to split this area up with New Canaan and the White and uh, Crazy Horns appropriately, but uh, if, if they don't want to be here, I mean, that's fine with me. Sure, why not? Encircle them, surround them, destroy them. I mean,. I'm really not sure what to do with these guys now, at this point. They have all their armies on the line against the enemy, and we're just strolling on in. Alright, well, whatever. You know. F fine enough with me. I mean, I'm, I'm totally okay with this. Monoplane fighters? Cool, yeah, why not? And let's get some more research. Probably try playing attackers, but we can get engine advancements anyways. Let's do that one first. Are we actually making planes yet? No, we're not, because we're out of water. One division, just single-handedly taking all these guys out. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and retreat this way, so we don't get encircled. That is actually probably a smart idea. Alright, you completed your objectives? Well, not really, but keep going. I mean, might as well, right? 
All right, at this point, I'm going to tell you guys to do this. I need you all to retreat. One, two, three. I need you guys to retreat right around here-ish. Hmm. You know what? Don't do that either. It's getting a little bit too dangerous for us. We'll go one, two, three, four, five. There we go. It's not bad. Nice. And, okay, so we got a pretty good defense here, then. Who is good? You guys looking pretty okay, then. Just gonna defend for now. We definitely gave him a spook over there, so... 8.2,000. Uh, 246. That's nice. Well, the Mormons have lost a lot. They really have. We haven't... We've lost 8. Not bad. Oh, man. They're really trying to push us down. That's okay. Retreat. Lower the line if you have to. I don't really care. Happy 2021, though, my friends. It's going to be a great year for us. Yeah, against two divisions, you're not going to be able to do anything against us. And here... Is exactly what we want. One, two. Now, the Mormons should be able to push a little harsher now that uh, we've kind of distracted them. Man, you guys take f so long. Oh, my goodness. I need to improve the infrastructure so badly. Right here. Let's grab this. Thank you very much. Less resistance. And now you guys can do this. Ah, we have all the crazy horns. Good. 52,000 manpower. Never enough. All right. Well, as we're just kind of waiting here. Make it a little bit more equipment first. That's okay with me. Make it a little bit more tank equipment as well. That'd be good. Uh, yeah, they kind of pierce us, but it doesn't really matter. Very good. Let them struggle against us. I'm not too worried unless someone goes to war with us, and then I'd be a little bit more worried then. You know, whatever. Uh, very good. It's just a fight for more water. That's all it is. The fight for more water. Oh, yes. Please attack me. Please see if you can win against us. We need a challenge. And these... Oh, man, you're actually not looking very good. Your strength is decreasing by a huge amount. Hold on. Uh, let's see. Their armor's not bad. Defense is actually pretty bad. So they literally could get crushed here. If I'm not using them for attack, that's not good. Uh, you can retreat that division, actually. Retreat. Now that it took that back, that, that thing back, it's fine. How many divisions have 82? I mean, we're starting to do some serious amount of damage to them, but... They're kind of doing that to themselves as well. So. Oh. There you go. Now I can really concentrate your forces there. You can put another division up from here over there too. That's be fine. Now they're seriously going to take a lot of losses. Oh, we've, taken, we've done more damage to them than they have. Uh, the enemy's basic aquifers would be very good as well. Nice. These guys can hold out. These guys... So these guys are really bad on defense. Like, attacking? Great. 46 defense, not worth it. Normal death claws, defense, 101. They know what they're doing. Probably. Probably. Over here, we probably want to core that next. Actually, can I core this area? I cannot. That's going to cost a lot of political power, which is fine. It is what it is. Ah, I got another division in there. Nice. Good. Let's kind of hang out for now. As we're slowly building ourselves up. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Platoon training, nice. Get even more organization. Let's grab some heavy melee weaponry next. Hmm. Hmm. That'd be kind of cool, actually. Hmm. I kind of want to go with that path. Yeah, we'll probably go with that path, too. All right, let's get some more water, maybe. Do that. Oh, we can't get any more water yet. That's fine. All right, so this means... Oh, 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 wait. Why are we attacking? Hold on, I did not say you guys... Oh, actually, technically, you should attack. Yeah, the, the breakthrough on these guys, not bad. Because we had this thing over here, so. Good, fine and dandy. Once these guys are gone... They, are they, do, are they doing the last stand? No? I'm not sure why it's taking so long to get over there. That's okay. I'm going to pull you guys out. Just because I don't want to hurt you guys too much. And supply is going to be kind of... Oh, you're defending. It's fine. Uh, good. Now come on out. Go to Red Henry. Just kind of hang out, chill out, have a good time, get a little bit more strength. That's all we really need right now. Uh, oh. Okay, well, I'm glad I looked over here. Well, that's not good. But, you know what, I think I'll end the episode here just because we're doing pretty well. At this point, we're just going to push as hard as we can through here, probably. 
Um, I think the video's gone long enough, and of course the 80s are dying. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow as we push further and further into Utah and core more and more territory. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.